Oppose gender-affirming care and LGBTQ ideologies, you can forget becoming a foster parent. New proposed Biden administration guidelines known as the Safe and Appropriate Foster Care Placement Requirements may prevent children from being placed in the homes of Christians. Well, joining us to explain is Dr. Jameson Taylor, senior fellow at the American Family Association. So, Jameson, 60% of licensed foster care homes claim to be practicing Christians. Tell us more, what might this mean for the U.S. foster care system? What listeners really need to understand about this is that this is not just about foster care. Certainly this rule and accompanying legislation in the Senate and the U.S. House, there's a bill called the Paris Hilton Bill. This rulemaking and this bill together will drive Christians out of the foster care system. But the most important thing for listeners to understand is that this is not just about foster care. When the Biden administration is saying that if you are a Christian parent or a Christian foster care provider, that you are not providing a safe environment for kids, what they mean is you're providing a dangerous environment for kids. And when kids are in danger, that's defined as abuse. So what they are literally doing is beginning to define Christian parents teaching a biblical worldview, define that as a form of abuse if you deny basically the LGBTQ lifestyle for your children. That is where this is headed. They're beginning with foster care, but there's a push already to terminate parental rights when parents do not agree with their child's chosen LGBTQ lifestyle.